You can't convince me, there's no way you'll convince me actually, that this isn't the best idea that I've literally ever had. I have built an entire team dedicated to the GOAT, Vita Veo. I'm serious, I'm not kidding. Vita Veo is one of the most fun cards that I have ever played. And he's not OP anymore, obviously, but he's still insanely fun. He's still got 99 truck, 98 brake tackle. He has solid speed and excel too, especially with all the chems I got him. I could make him like even more insane if I had like a Tampa Bay Buccaneers themed team, but I didn't want to do that because I had some other ideas with this team too. We have a beautiful offensive line. He has outside zone guru, bruiser, and homer, so he can activate his X-Factor a little faster. My other X-Factors on offense is a left guard, and a right guard. Randall McDaniel and David DeCastro were both insanely good. Their abilities, both of them have. Run block elite, which is stronger blocking on all run plays, and nasty streak. Dominant impact blocks against DBs and LBs, which means when they get to the second level of the defense, they'll start lighting people up. Now, ironically, this is the exact strategy that the guy who won the Madden competitive, the guy who won the Madden competitive scene, like the whole tourney, this was his exact strategy. He had a left guard and right guard X-Factored, and then he had Walter Payton, I believe, with his other X-Factor, and he had a puncher at QB. So this is, is technically viable. I'm nowhere near as good as those guys. I don't expect to go insane and Vita Vea is kind of slow, right? But my goal is just to spam the shit out of Vita Vea and see if I can either make someone rage quit or just straight up get a win. Okay. Now a lot of this will be dependent on my defense playing well, which I expect it to. My defense is awesome. I still love it. Should play amazing. But it's going to come down to this. It's going to be a lot of fun. We got we got Barry at backup for Peak Zone Bubble. Can still do that. Now, one thing that I haven't done yet that I do need to switch out. I'll be putting a tight end at every single wide receiver position. Now, I don't really care what tight end it is. It's not super important to me. The point is they're a big body who's going to be able to throw a nasty block for Vita Vea on Peak Zone Bubble or any stretch run plays. Koi Schlesinger already throws good blocks. I could get Quentin Nelson out of position, but I don't think he's fast enough to set the edge, so I'm going to stick with what I'm doing here. So now we got Engram, Zach Ertz, and our final blocker will be Cole Komet. I don't even know, is that how you say his name? Is it the K silent? Is it Cole Met? I don't know, or care. <laughs> Sorry Bears fans, I don't care about your second round pick. I just don't. The point is, on every peak zone bubble or any stretch run play, there's always a big body block. I don't plan to throw to anybody ever, other than Vita Vea. Maybe I'll use Barry on the give for peak zone bubble if he really commits, but it's gonna depend a lot on how our opponent plays. Either way, I'm ready for the game. Let's do this. This is gonna be sick. I'm so excited. Also, huge thank you to Manscaped for continuing to sponsor my videos. Look, we're all stuck inside right now thinking of ways to stay clean and hygienic. And Manscaped is your savior. Manscaped is the only men's brand dedicated to below the waist grooming. Also, I don't know if you guys are into gardening at all, but if you've got a bunch of bushes surrounding a tree and you trim the bushes, the tree looks way taller if you catch my drift. And that is why Manscaped has redesigned the electric trimmer. This is the Lawnmower 3.0. The greatest ball hair trimmer ever created. It's got a cutting edge ceramic blade up here so you don't nick yourself while shaving. The battery lasts up to 90 minutes. Been using the lawnmower 3.0 personally for four months now, never cut myself and I look real good. I'm not gonna stand up and prove it, but trust me on that one. So you can get 20% off and free shipping with the code MMG at manscaped.com. Again, that's 20% off, free shipping, manscaped.com, use the code MMG. Also make sure you check out the Perfect Package 3.0. As a subscriber, you get 20% off your order instantly. A new replacement blade refill for your lawnmower trimmer. That'll be delivered to your door every three months. You also get a travel bag and Manscaped boxer briefs. And of course, a link for all of this will be in the top of the description, so you can always just click that. Manscaped, thanks for sponsoring, boys. Enjoy the rest of the video. Navarro Bowman, Joe Gervicius, Gervicius, ah! <laughs> I've been having that problem all year. Either way, it doesn't look like a god squad. I think we got a good shot here. Oh, dude, these jerseys, too. These are my clown uniforms. Got them from Antonio Brown himself. This is literally perfect for what I'm doing here. Let's do it. Lots of things should work here. The edge should set because I have outside zone guru, but the inside run should work well, too, because I've got right guard, left guard X factors. I also have excellent blocks from Engram. There's a lot that can work here. Let's see, Avita Vea, come here! Okay, what? Wow, that would have been so hype, and it just We're gonna go the exact same thing, get it to the edge. It really was there, it just got, oh, up the middle! Let's go. They got around those so easy, but it still kind of works. Oh, he knows too. All right, you know what? I'll throw underneath to Mr. Vita Vea. Come on, baby. Come on, baby, he's got it! 
Let's go! Let's go. Wait, they called, They counted that as a rush. They counted that as a run play. It must have been because the pass was backwards. Third and nine, and damn, Vitave is still not in. Okay, he knows peak zone bubble. I can say that much. We're just going to go Edmonds to the edge. Thank you. Not taking an enforcer. And we got some beautiful yards there. Let's get Vitave back in. The only issue is he knows peak zone bubble, so he might just sit on this. Yeah, he's going to sit on Vitave there. Damn. That makes me sad. Okay. Okay. Dude, did you see that block from Randall McDaniel? That was nasty streak right there. Dude, he flattened. He flattened that linebacker. Look at that shit. I can run read option, can I? Damn, Barry's in. No Vita Vey on this one. Let's see if he bites, though. He does bite. That should be a first. Easy. Could have gotten a lot more, honestly. Let's take my first, though. All right, we're just going to hand this one straight off to Barry. The blocking from these guards is so broken. Second and six, we're going to go with the run. Or we're going to go with the pass. Actually, no. No, no, no. Vita Vea. Same shit, different day. Easy handoff. Let's see it. Get to the edge. Ah, Enforcer. Enforcer is so dumb. Who does he have at QB? What am I looking at? Is this peak zone bubble? This is peak zone bubble. This is 100% peak zone bubble. Wow, that's a bold call, my friend. Oh, and I adjusted for that too. We still didn't stop it though. He is not punting from the 14. Okay, he has, sorry, not Trent McSorley. It's Trace McSorley. He's a 68 overall. What am I looking at here? Trent! Jeff Okuda does not get the interception, but I don't see it mattering. He has this really good defense. And then this absolute bum QB! So lucky. Count your blessings that you did not just walk into Vita Vea's 400 pound, 6 foot 5 dominant ass. Cheeks. Count them. Count your blessings right now. 7 0, Vita Vea. Goated. And I think he's quitting. 2,000 years later. Alright, we gotta get sketchy here. I'm gonna put Vita Vea in the middle of the field and I'm gonna give him a playmaker. Yep. All right, so let's roll out right. Oh my God, he's so open. No! Oh my God, he was literally so open. I feel so bad. I just let down my country. Is this going to be a peak zone bubble here on third and eight? No, it's not. I thought for sure I got... Oh, this land's covered. Taylor Mays. Wait, get up, get up. Ooh. Said love you been watching. Hey, appreciate it, my guy. But you got to let me know why you got Trace McSorley at QB. I need to know. Also, if you love me so much, could you play the damn game? Everyone loves me so much that they literally sit here and pause for 10 plus minutes. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna playmaker him left. He sees it with his user. He just aggressive caught that. I add caught that with Vita Vea. Vita Vea was literally born to play football, baby. He's born. I'm gonna feed him. I'm gonna feed him an RPO piece. I don't care if his user goes straight on top of this. I'm feeding it to him. Actually, no. I I'm gonna, I'm gonna pin it to him. Wait, Vita, Vea! Oh, no, no, no! Oh my God, he made such a good catch, dude. He made such a good catch. He was a yard short, dude. He pirouetted, dude. He, ooh, he spun like he was 145 pounds. <laughs> this is tight end attack. Okay, underneath. That's a good play. Oh, that was a non-enforcer. Who got that hit? Good God. All right, we're going to try and hit this. We hit this last time. It was so good. Or it was open last time. We didn't hit it. I fucked up. Oh, no, damn. Not even going to get the pass off. Got sacked too fast. Darn. Let's see what we can do. Third and four. He knows exactly what I'm doing. But can he stop it? But can he stop it? But can he stop it? Let's go, Vito. 23 rushes, 123 yards. I'm not gonna lie, I totally forgot about the possibility of running a slip screen. It looks pretty open! Vita! Vita! Let's go! Slip screen! Not to mention the fact that he really got hit on the two, and he still powered his way in. I'm going with the inside zone. I'm going the inside zone on third and goal. That Amos is gonna come in hot. He can't get there! Two-point conversion. I could throw virtually anything here. I'm probably gonna throw Ertz on the slant. Is this user there? Yes. Wow, what a lurk. What a lurk. I don't think I'm gonna be able to get back. I don't think anybody... Oh, wait, Barry? Barry, can you pull it off? Is he gonna slow down? 
Is he gonna run out of steam? <laughs> no, he doesn't. And then that's one, two, three at Yahoo. <laughs>